The following is a production by Lone Star Community Radio, Montgomery County's community radio station. You can support Lone Star Community Radio by donating and sponsoring programs just like this. For more information, check us out online at IRLoneStar.com. This segment is brought to you by... Since 2004, Roger Stein Chiropractic has offered spine and joint manipulation services to residents of Montgomery County and surrounding areas. Conditions treated include lower back pain, migraines, headaches, whiplash, carpal tunnel, neck pain, sciatica, joint pain, sports injuries, herniated discs, and complications from pregnancy. Roger Stein Chiropractic, led by Dr. Stacy Rogers and Dr. Brian McGee, is an integrity verified chiropractic clinic. Call 936 441 9990 for an appointment or visit rogersteinchiropractic.com. That's R O D G E R S S T E I N chiropractic.com. Team Sinisi is a proud sponsor of Conroe Culture News. Vinny Sinisi and his professional team provide comprehensive real estate services throughout the greater Montgomery County area and beyond. Whether looking to buy, sell, or invest in real estate, Team Sinisi has an impeccable reputation. Contact Team Sinisi for a great experience at TeamSinisi.com. That's T-E-A-M-S-I-N-I-S-I.com. And we are back with Tom Faust. He is the Senior Vice President of Sales at Margaritaville Lake Resort on Lake Conroe. And he comes on the show quite often so that we can stay in tune with what's happening at Margaritaville. Because that is the place to be, your staycation destination. And they've been open over a year now. I believe the anniversary was end of June. And there's lots of things going on. Uh, So tell us about what's happening, Tom. Well, thanks, Mary Jane. Thanks for having me on the show again. I really appreciate it. You know, there's always a lot going on at Margaritaville, and the first thing I want to talk about is holiday events, because I think people don't think about holiday events until, you know, November, December, but actually this is our most popular time, October, to be booking holiday events, and that would be holiday parties, etc. So we've got, um, you know, a variety of meeting spaces and event spaces around the resort that are perfect for holiday events. And I think people also typically think of holiday events, you know, as big events. Well, we'll do, you know, 10 or 20 person events, we'll do 500 person events. And we've got the spaces to do it. And of course, Margaritaville will be decorated in holiday splendor. It'll look fantastic, be a great place for your 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 personal or your corporate holiday event. Now, the other thing to think about is it's really the three, the first three weekends of December are the most popular dates, and those are filling up, as you might imagine. So think about, alternatively, doing it on a Thursday or a Sunday. So not only will you probably get a better uh, event venue that's more suited to you, you'll probably get a better deal as well. Well, you so, probably get a better attendance, too, because it doesn't absolutely. conflict with so many other things. And if it's a business Christmas party, right. you know, you want to spend time with family on the weekends, generally. Absolutely. So that it gives better opportunity. I, I love that idea. Right. And, you know, and a lot of people start to do that. So our catering department, call our catering department at 936-448-3103. Or go to our website and you can, you know, easily fill out an RFP and give us the information about your event and our team will follow up with you. So we're, we're anxious to host your event at Margaritaville this season. And you have some incentives going along with that as well. well. We, we have a number of incentives. I think the, the most fun incentive we have is uh, if you book an event of a certain size, and this is all on our website, you'll get a free Margaritaville frozen concoction maker, which is basically a margarita maker. <laughs> Yeah. Um, which is a lot of fun. So, yeah, and you, can, and you can use that, you know, as a personal incentive. You could use that to raffle off a prize during your event. You could use that to reward somebody on your team that goes over, you know, over and above. And Whatever. if you don't want to do that, we'll give you a $200 credit against your bill. So there's a lot of ways that you can uh, you can enjoy that incentive. But that's uh, through the end of the year. So, you know, move move quickly and Sooner make sure. the better. Yeah, because you're gonna, we're going to run out of space. Uh, and it's so, already getting yeah, booked, right? It, is. Those, yeah, it certainly is. So you're going to want to move quickly to book those events. Okay. Lots so of, what, what's happening with Halloween? That's oh this my. week. Yeah, that's this weekend, right? <laughs> right? So this, 
So this Saturday, we've got a lot going on. You know, the weather on the weekends has been absolutely spectacular. Yes. And anticipate that that will continue. So a great combination of indoor-outdoor events. So starting at 9 a.m., we've got uh, S- Supernatural Morning Yoga on Water Point Landing. Don't ask me anything more about that. <laughs> have you done that? We've got, I have not, <laughs> but you never know. I might show up, might show up Saturday. Um, we've got Holloway fu- Halloween Fun in Palm Court. So just a variety of games for for families to play and compete with. And, of course, they might be some candy there as rewards. We've got a balloon maker. We've got a spooky DJ uh, at the pool. And, of course, remember, two of our pools are heated. So our five o'clock, upper 5 o'clock somewhere pool is heated, as is our slide pool. And we also have two heated outdoor spots. So you do have, you know, if the weather... Uh, doesn't support it, and it probably will, uh, you do have two heated pool options to enjoy. We've also got a pumpkin painting contest at 1 o'clock. We've got a family costume contest at 3 o'clock. We've got Halloween karaoke from 5 to 9 at our new boathouse bar and restaurant. At 7.30, we've got a bar crawl. Uh, that you will go to a number of the bar venues at Margaritaville and complete a booklet and uh, win a prize for completing that. 8 p.m., we've got a um, spooky movie on the event lawn. And then at 9 p.m., we've got an adult costume contest at Landshark. So really, from 9 o'clock in the morning to 9 o'clock at night, we've got a whole whole bunch of fun Halloween events. Uh, events planned for for now are these for the public or are these for guests or day passes or how does that work yeah they're really intended to be for the public uh, i'm sorry to be for guests Guests. and and members right okay Uh, but you know the the, you know the adult costume anything like in a restaurant or bar like land shark or boathouse is certainly open to the public as well so it's really a combination of those things and again this is all on our website so I can't talk fast enough to describe it. <laughs> you don't have to talk right. fast. <laughs> then the, the next event I want to talk about, we're very excited about this because it's, it's the first time we've done it. Uh, Tom Shepard is a good friend of Margaritaville. Tom is a, like I think they call him a trop rock artist. Tom's also a Grammy Award winning musician, songwriter, and singer. So he's a very talented guy. Trop rock kind of refers to Jimmy Buffett style music is probably the best way to describe it. Uh, so Tom's a talented guy. Um, and we're going to do a singer-songwriter event. And I don't know if anybody's, has, if you've participated in those, but it's it's very interesting. It's acoustic, so they're, they're going to unplug. They're going to get their acoustic guitars out. And Tom and Jason Allen, another Texas songwriter, will join them. And they're going to be on a couple of stools in front of the room in our boathouse at 7 p.m. on Thursday, November 11th. And what they'll do is they'll talk about the songs that they've written, what motivated them, what was going on in their lives, who recorded them. And then uh, occasionally they'll break into the song and then they'll go back to talking about the songs. It's really a lot of fun and it's... uh, it's, it can be very moving because, as you might imagine, it's very personal when they talk about their motivation for these songs. It's more talking, informal. Yeah, you know, they're talking about points in their life. So it's it's not really a performance. It's very interactive right. uh, with with the folks in the stand with, with the folks in the audience. So that's as well. Veterans Day, November 11th. It is Veterans Day, and so that's the tickets are twenty nine dollars. We'll have those on our website very soon. That's but very mark affordable. your calendars for November eleventh yeah. um, at seven p.m. in our new boathouse. Next up. Uh, Margie would be Thanksgiving brunch. Can't believe we're talking about Thanksgiving, but here we are. Once you have it, Halloween, it, it all it, rolls it, fast. It, it really does. And you know, <laughs> you know what we're going to talk about after Thanksgiving. So, yes, yes. So Thanksgiving is uh, Thursday, November twenty fifth. We're going to do our brunch from ten a. Well, for a brunch from ten a.m. to three p.m. Uh, for adults, it's sixty four ninety five. Children are twenty four ninety five. We have an amazing menu. Uh, children under six are complimentary. Our members receive a 20% discount. We're going to have live entertainment, fall cocktails, mimosas, Bloody Marys. Ooh, sounds a, nice. A fabulous, uh, a fabulous um, uh, menu there. And for reservations, call 936-448-3224. Which restaurant is this at? This will be in Del Lago Ballroom, okay. which is the big okay. glass with beautiful floor-to-ceiling uh, views of Lake Conroe mm-hmm. in the back of our conference center. And it seats about 350, 400 people, so we'll have plenty of room. And that's 10, so that's um, 10 to 3 on Thanksgiving Day. Nice. And, of course, then um, we, we have our, uh, I guess, probably be our last Little Palm Boat Cruise of the year just because of temperature. Mm-hmm. And that's on November 20th, um, and that will be at... 530 because we always try to time it with sunset mm-hmm. and I believe sunset that night is 
uh, like 5.45. I don't know. It'll have yeah. to be after the time change. It will, yeah. So we <laughs> lose an hour. And that's uh, dinner and cruise out on Lake Conroe on the Little Palm. Adults are $99, children $69, and children under four. There's no charge. So it's a, always a fun event. So come out and enjoy that. And that's for guests, the public, and members as well. You know, that would be a fun thing to do for the Christmas parade. Uh, he's involved in the Christmas parade. But so that he's, would, yeah, he's, I mean, he's out there. Um, I don't know. <laughs> yeah, absolutely. Just a thought. <laughs> Then of course you knew what you know what's coming next. Yep. Um, after we talk about Thanksgiving, you have to talk about Christmas, right? And Santa so, Claus. The, so <laughs> absolutely. So this year we're going to have three breakfasts with Santa on three consecutive Saturdays. Last year we did it once. It was great. It sold out, uh, and so there was a lot of demand from parents and grandparents to bring the kiddos. So we're going to try to do this three times. That's Saturday, December fourth. Saturday, December 11th, Saturday, December 18th. So the three, the first three Saturdays of December. It will also will be in Del Lago Ballroom. Uh, we've got Santa there, and we've got Elsa from Frozen will be there for oh, the kids as well. Yes. Um, and so for adults, it's $38.95, and children is $19.95, under six complimentary. We'll have a great menu of fun and uh, fun Christmas uh, holiday-oriented food. Uh, of course, mimosas and Bloody Marys for moms and dads and grandmas and grandpas. Uh, members receive a 20% discount. Uh, a lot of interactive games and fun things for the kids to do, live music, etc. So that is, call us at 936-448-3224 for Breakfast with Santa. And that's Saturdays, December 4th, 11th, and 18th. This so sounds so much fun. It's It'll be great. It was great <laughs> last time. And, and I, I can't confirm this, Margie, but I've heard that Santa may be arriving by boat. So we'll cool. have to see. We'll have to see what happens okay. there. So you're okay. going to want to definitely want to going to come out and see that. Mm-hmm. And I mentioned again. I want to mention again that that's nine to nine to twelve. Um, all right. Then also planning uh, New Year's Eve uh, at at Margaritaville. So ring in the year with a tropical inspired Margaritaville celebration. Uh, New Year's Eve, of course, is a Friday this year on the 31st, um, and we're going to have programming in our Boathouse Restaurant and Bar as well as our Land Shark uh, uh, Restaurant. We'll have a cash bar in the lobby with live entertainment. In License to Chill, our restaurant that's in the, on, in the lobby, we'll have a prefix menu uh, all evening. We'll have charcuterie and wine flights in Joe Merchants. So we're, we're working on the whole entertainment schedule that we'll have in the Boathouse and Land Shark. But you will, and this is for the public, and this is for guests, and this is for members. So you you can stay there and enjoy it, or you can just come. Uh, I love that because last event. year I I don't think there was anything. A few big things, deal. but if you may remember uh, we had everything. We had a great plan. Everything was outside, and, the, and it got very cold. And at the eleventh hour, we had to bring everything. It was still fun, but it would have been more fun if it was outside. So this year we're planning indoors. And maybe if we get lucky, we'll move out. So just the opposite. Sounds fun. Sounds so like a great weekend since yeah, it's Friday night, you know? Yeah. And then you can stay the weekend. Right. You know? That's what we'll, I'm thinking. We'll have brunch on Saturday and, and Sunday available. So come in, go to brunch, go to Boathouse, watch some football. We've got a great HD 135-inch television in there. You and can, heated pools. He, and two heated pools, <laughs> you know. And you can watch all the football and the parades and have a really great New that Year's. That really sounds New Year's fun. Weekend. And it will, safe. It will be fun. Safe. Very, you know, well, it's you all about being you safe. You don't have to drive anywhere, right? You're yeah, right there. absolutely. I love that idea. Yeah. You don't want to be on the road. No. That's our fall lineup, and that's our holiday lineup. Well, that's so, exciting. as usual, lots going on at Margaritaville. So, let's back up. Let's talk sure. about the Boathouse okay. Bar and Lounge. Yeah. Tell me about that and where it's located there yeah. at Margaritaville. So, we opened about 10 days ago, um, well, about two weeks ago in Boathouse. It's actually in the conference center, so it's directly across okay. from the front door of the lobby and the boathouse is really a fun venue um, it'll be up on our website soon we just did a photo shoot last week so you'll be able to see that but it's really it's got a stage a uh, great sound system it's got seven tvs in there it's really designed for lineup live entertainment comedy it's got a dance floor it's got of course the, re- the required by law disco ball over the dance floor <laughs> it's got a um <laughs> You could call it a golf simulator, but it's really a sports simulator. I okay. think there's 15 different sports. People really have a ball with that. 
so you've got that in there. You've got a, a raised VIP section. Is it a restaurant as well? Yeah, I mean it's okay. you know they they have a they have their own restaurant menu, so food is available there. It's a, kind of a very Texas themed restaurant. We just uh, got our own, just bought our own, a new smoker, so a lot of smoked, you know, brisket and things like that. That's a lot of fun, um, and uh, so. It's you know really themed after we'll have a DJ or live entertainment in there, almost every night. It's right now it's open Wednesdays Wednesdays through Sundays. Okay. Um, you know, it's Sunday we really focus on football, and well Saturdays too with with college football. So you see a lot of that. Then the rest of the time is live entertainment evenings. It's kind of a late night place. People tend to go there after dinner or that kind of thing, and. You know, well, and it's great the, if you're staying there perfect. as well. Right. Okay. And it's right across from the – and, again, it's safe. Um, we do a lot of um, wedding room blocks, as you might imagine. So yeah. they tend to head there after they get back from their receptions and have a great time in the boathouse. So it's got a view of the Close the light, night down. Really casual, <laughs> fun place, very much Car- very much a Caribbean theme to it. Right. Um, so it's, it's really a fun place. It's great. Well, I can't wait to go by and yeah, see that. So fun. what are we missing? I think we kind of covered a lot of different things. You're still oh, having brunch every Saturday and every Sunday, Every Saturday. Too. Every, I'm sorry, every Sunday, Sunday? In, in License to Chill. We have uh, okay. Sunday brunch as well. We have a buffet breakfast on Saturdays and Sundays in um, uh, Water, Point, Water Point Cove. Yeah, water cycle. A lot of options. A lot of options. Yeah, well, you know, we have now with uh, Boathouse, we have six uh, restaurants at the resort. So, you know, people want to stay there, you know, three, four days. They want to have plenty of options and go to a variety of different places. And you've increased the menu items as well. We have. Yeah, we just changed the menu and license to chill, and it's getting very, very good feedback. So, yeah, we, um, we, so you've got a lot of options when you stay there as well. Very good. Okay. So, what are we lacking? Happy holidays. (laughs) I know. So you have a Facebook page. They can go there and put in uh, Margaritaville, Lake Conroe Resort, and and find it. It's very eagle to Google that, and you can do that the same um, to find your website. And they have you have different navigation things at the top, things to do, holiday events. And if they wanted to find out more about the Christmas parties to book for business, that is also under the uh, business tab, I believe. Um, All right there. And in addition to that, you have the things that you've been doing, which is the brewery tours, yeah, wine I don't know if you tours, saw that, but they were all just, of that. They were just featured in the weekend. I did uh, see that. Woodlands, help me out. The Woodlands, it's not the Woodlands Journal, but it's Woodlands something, Online. Yeah, something like that. Okay. I, I I, I've seen the, them in a couple. I places. saw the hard copy version of it, but I'm sure it was in the same place. So our partners there with Texas Craft Brewery Tours are doing a special. Uh, for Veterans Day, where they're offering complimentary yes, tours. Yes, I saw to that too. Which, yeah, which I really thought was which great. I shared on yeah, social it's wonder- media. Wonderful that they're good, doing that. Good guys. Yeah, they're they're terrific guys. Yeah. And so they we do uh, weekend all weekend long. Um, we do tours leaving of of craft breweries in the Conroe area as well as a craft winery tour. Uh, so we do that every weekend. We also have a package and shuttle service to Bernhardt Winery that does concerts every Sunday night. So you can stay with us. And they're the continuing shuttle, that, they right? Are. The Sunday yeah, concerts. In November right now, I Okay. Believe. I know sometimes uh, they do uh, an event in December as they, well, a couple may. events. I think a lot of it yeah. probably weather dependent. Sure, they are absolutely. Outdoors. Um, and so, and you can, so again, from a safety perspective, come stay at Margaritaville, hop on the shuttle, go down to the winery, you know, you know, sample some great wine and some charcuterie, and then you come back and spend the night at Margaritaville. So that's, a, that's really a fun it's package easy. as well. It's, it's just easy. Very, it's, just... it's very easy. And, and then the other thing, you know, we're a sponsor of the Texas Renaissance Festival, and we have a package that, um, if, that gives you tickets, uh, well, gives you a, a special rate on Saturday nights and tickets, free tickets. So that's two tickets. Two tickets is a sixty-eight dollar value, so two tickets to the Renaissance Festival on Sundays. And then we also have a fifteen percent off when you show if you already have tickets, fifteen percent off your room rate when you show your Texas Renaissance Festival ticket stub. Um, and the Texas Renaissance Festival is every weekend of October, all the way through the end of November, mm-hmm. uh, right up to right through I should say Thanksgiving weekend. And so you could and book and come out there for Thanksgiving, Absolutely. your Thanksgiving meal, and stay the night, go to the Renaissance Festival, Absolutely. and all the other activities. Yeah, and they're just, <laughs> you know, uh, Renaissance Festival is just down the road. So, right. you know, we're, we're, we're by far the closest hotel uh, to the, you know, full-service hotel to the Renaissance Festival. So. Well, I think you're one of the best resort 
destinations well, around. Thank you. We think so you too. Know? I mean, yeah. You know, there's so you, many options. You've got a world class resort in your backyard, and you're on the which lake, is, which is incredible, right? Of course, you know we have boating and all the restaurants and all the amenities. Spa. And, you know, got a gorgeous spa. Golf. Golf. Tennis, pickleball, miniature golf. Football, miniature golf, and it's all, it's in your backyard. So you can rent a boat. We're very, very, <laughs> uh, very fortunate uh, to be able to offer that to the community. Absolutely. Well, thank you, Tom. I appreciate you coming Pleasure. on and updating us because who doesn't want to hear about what's happening at Margaritaville? Um, I mean, it's the place to be. It just puts a smile on your face, right? It does. <laughs> Thanks for having me. Change that disposition. Yeah. Well, thank you very much, and uh, hopefully we'll see you this week at uh, Margaritaville. I'm sure. Thank you, Marge. I appreciate it.